Hello everyone, I'm Rafael Donaro and today I'm here in Menaggio, Italy, in this amazing place. And uh, today I'm gonna talk about three reasons that cause bugs and stress. So the third reason that uh, cause bugs and stress is a lack of knowledge. Because, uh, I mean, if, if you don't know the Java language, for example, really deeply, you're gonna have to um, reinvent the wheel. You're gonna have to, um, for example, do something much more complex than it should be. So, um, a really simple example is the set interface. So, if we are using the set interface and um, you don't implement the equals and hash code methods, you won't be able to use the, the power of this amazing interface. And even worse, if you don't know about the set interface that you can use unique elements, you would have to create a lot of ifs on your code. This is a, just a simple example, but uh, it can be much, much worse. Uh, so lack of knowledge is uh, a big problem. Um, and this can be applied to frameworks as well. So be sure to know the, the um, main concepts of the framework that you are working with. The second reason is um, about tests. So if you don't cover your code, it's, I mean, there's, there's no way to, to know where there is a bug. So with automated tests, you run uh, all tests really easily and you can track down bugs really easily as well. So make sure that you have tests in your application as well. One other thing that's important is about um, code quality. Because if you implement tests, your code quality will be much better because um, programmers will think twice before implementing the code. So they're going to implement the code in a much better way, in a more uh, focused way. They're going to think about uh, having low coupling and have um, a high cohesion. So that's, that's why it's important. So we're going to cover um, your code and also we're going to create better better code because with tests um, um, you, you just think in a better design to your code and uh, the first reason the first reason I believe it's uh, focusing on numbers so um, for example if um, people in charge of your project focus just on numbers um, quality will be just forgotten and that's a problem because it's just an illusion, illusion of numbers, creating numbers like useless. Um, you would be just going through stress, you wouldn't have time to your family, to, your, um, to yourself, you wouldn't have the opportunity to be happy. <laughs> so um, it's important for us to focus on soft skills because uh, if, if we don't know um, soft skills, if, if we don't know how to negotiate it's it's tough because uh, everyone will do will make every decision they they want and they're gonna have to accept I mean if you are quiet if, if you don't speak up things will just uh, decisions will be made so we speak up and uh, expose your ideas because your idea might make a huge difference in your project so if you are quiet, you are agreeing with the situation that's happening. So sometimes you just have to speak up because if you don't do that, we are not uh, doing our best. So, okay, so just to, re to recap, it's um, third reason is to uh, have a lack of knowledge um, about the programming language or frameworks. Second reason is about tests, not covering tests, and uh, the first reason is focusing on numbers. So, better saying, mistakes. So, um, yeah, that's it for today, and um, see you later. See you in the uh, next opportunity.
and give a like to to the video if you um, uh, liked the video of course and um, yeah get subscribed so see you guys